everyone. Today I was wanting to do a video on how I personally do my crossplay makeup. Um, I have two different versions of crossplay makeup. One is for younger characters and one is for older characters. So I just thought I'd go ahead and show you both. So here we go. To begin, you will need two things. First, a contouring shadow. I'm using this dark shadow from Revlon. And you will need a big, fluffy brush like this. To begin, you're going to load up your brush with the dark shadow and just brush along your jawbone and your chin. The goal here is to define your jaw as much as you can and make it look stronger, which is common for male characters. So you're going to keep brushing and blending until you are satisfied with the look of your jaws. And then, ta-da! You are done! Building up from the young male look, we are now going to darken our cheekbones. So, load up your fluffy brush with your contour powder, and just brush the powder along your cheekbones. The way you find this is to suck in your cheeks, and find where it's hollow and just brush it in. And if it looks too dark to you, then you can just easily blend away with your hand and just keep brushing and building up the color until you're satisfied with how it looks. Now we're going to move on to contouring our eyes. So for the eyes, you're going to need an eyeshadow brush like this, and we're going to focus on the hollows of our eyes. So load up the eyeshadow brush with your contour powder, find the hollows of your eyes, and blend this color into the hollows. Because you want your eyes to look a little more sunken in. So just keep applying the powder and moving the brush in a windshield wiper motion until you're satisfied with how dark it looks. And if you make any mistakes, you can easily brush it away. And then just do it to the other side. Just keep blending back and forth in a windshield wiper motion until you're satisfied with how your eyes look. The last step is to darken our eyebrows. And for this step, you're going to need an angled eyeshadow brush. So load up the brush, and then you're going to brush the hairs back with your fingers to make them look a little more bushy. Once you do that, then you're going to run the brush over your eyebrows to make them look darker. Now for this step, depending on which character you have, obviously change the color of the shadow accordingly. You can see how now that eyebrow looks darker than the other one. And just remember, these tips are pretty general, pretty basic. They can be changed depending on which character you're going for. So you don't have to always do your eyes or do the eyebrows. Just do whatever fits the character. And now you are done. Thanks for watching, and you can like, favorite, subscribe, and comment with what you guys want me to do for another makeup tutorial. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you later. Bye!